second John, the elder to the elect lady and her children, whom I love in truth. And not only I, not I only, but also all those who have known the truth, because of the truth remaining among us, and will be with us forever. Grace, mercy, peace will be with you from God the Father and from the Lord Jesus Christ, the Son of the Father, in truth and love. I rejoiced greatly because I found your children walking in truth as we received command from the Father. And I now request you, lady, not writing as a new commandment, but one which we had from the beginning, that we should love one another. And this is love, that we should walk according to his this is the commandment, even as you heard from the beginning, that you should walk in it. Because many deceivers went out into the world, those not confessing Jesus Christ to have come in the flesh. This is the deceiver and the antichrist. Watch yourselves that we may not lose the things we worked out, but that we may receive a full reward. Everyone transgressing and not abiding in the teaching of Christ does not have God. The one abiding in the teaching of Christ, this one has the Father and the Son. If anyone comes to you and does not bear this teaching, do not receive him into the house, and do not speak a greeting to him. For the one speaking a greeting shares in his evil works. Having many things to write to you, I do not intend to speak by means of paper and ink, but I am hoping to come to you and to speak mouth to mouth, that our joy may be full. The children of your elect sister greet you. Amen.